Greetings to everyone out there and welcome back to Around the Clock. Alright everybody, last night Nintendo dropped two, well technically three interesting updates for the Nintendo Switch and to get things started, let's talk about this major issue that Nintendo finally fixed that was causing a lot of problems for Switch users, so let's get into it. As you can see in this article posted by Nintendo Life the other day, Switch System Update 19.0.0 is apparently causing some issues and I talked about this in a previous video where this firmware update was causing some issues while in handheld mode where the console would not go into sleep mode properly. Also, this was causing issues for downloads, battery life was draining, as well as the consoles were overheating. So yes, this was a major issue to the point where a lot of people were contacting Nintendo themselves to see if they could get this issue resolved. And lo and behold, Nintendo did respond with a update late last night. As you can see here on Nintendo's official support page, we fixed some issues and improved the stability and usability of the game, including the following fixed an issue where the Nintendo GameCube controller connection tab would sometimes not be recognized. Also, they fixed an issue where communication processes such as software downloads would not function properly during sleep mode. So yes, it looks like all the issues that were caused by the brand new update 19.0.0 have been resolved and hopefully this helps a lot of people. So it looks like it's safe to download this brand new update that was released yesterday 19.0.1. And just as a heads up for those of you who don't already have this, you know, set in your settings for your Switch, go into your settings and take off automatic download of brand new firmware updates. And you should do this for all the technology that you own, your gaming consoles, your cell phones, tablets, laptops, computers, do this for all of those because you never know what these updates could present. It could be a virus or anything on these things. So yeah, man, make sure to do that as soon as possible. Now let's get into the final topic of this video, which involves Nintendo Shadow dropping two fan favorite games on the NSO plus expansion pack, Shadow Man and Turok 2 for the N64 console. Nintendo just shadow dropped these games out of nowhere so if you have the NSO plus expansion pack and you never played these games or if you played these games before back in the day on the N64 definitely check these out because these are cult classics. And what's interesting about this is because Nintendo just released Banjo-Tooie last week Thursday for the NSO plus expansion pack and today or yesterday last night they shadow dropped these two games Shadow Man and Turok 2 so Currently, Nintendo is just pumping out these NSO games and hopefully they keep doing this because they have plenty of games in their libraries to do so. With that being said guys, that's going to do it for this video and please make sure to like this video, share this video, and for all of you watching this video right now that are not already subscribed, make sure to hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell so that you don't miss out on daily Nintendo news content because here at Around the Clock, we focus on Nintendo news content around the clock. I'll catch you guys in the next video.